studying, studying, studying a wasp, and we we were experimenting what he liked to eat, and and we found out if we cut out paper paper flowers and put some honey on it, that the wasp is feeding. If you can have a look. I'm going to show you with a magnifying glass how to do it. Okay, I'll, I'm just going to open it and push it on. See? That wasp is the only wasp we've ever done this with. And um, I'm very proud that we've actually managed to do it. Okay, let go of the microphone, please. Oh, he scared you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I just think you want to say. <laughs> <laughs> and the wasp we've got here, we don't know if it's a paper wasp or not. It, we don't know what type of wasp it is. Some wasps have got an abdomen really thin and long, like a like a sort of a really thin hose. If you uh, make it uh, sort of that thin, that's what it'll be like, or a bit thinner maybe. Well, we don't actually know what kind this wasp is, and I'll see you later. I'll see you. I hope you study wasps at home and you can find them that they're really nice. When we tried to get when we tried yesterday night, when we when we tried to let him out, he just stayed in. I'm sure he wanted to stay there. Goodbye. Let them out once you studied them. Because then they'll die maybe in here. And what they eat is honeydew, sm spiders, birds, uh, some other things. Well, they eat honey. Well, because we saw him a bit earlier on eating. And we're going to look up on the internet more to, to, to find more research on the wasp.